Do you like a jelly baby? Shut up! Well, simple enough, thank you, would have been sufficient. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is while you're watching this. And following on from my Tracer 10,000 mile review, Stoll181, uh, link below to their channel, told me that you can actually fit an AGV flip-up helmet into the pannier on a Tracer 9 using the Yamaha luggage. And indeed you can if you put it in upside down. Not how I would want to put a helmet in a pannier, but there you go. However, closing the lid, I did find a couple of witness marks on opening it, as you can see here. So I wouldn't put a helmet in a pannier without a helmet bag on. So here we go, let's see if it'll still fit. It's quite a squeeze. So taking the pannier from the bike and giving it a bit of shake and vac, I can't hear the helmet moving inside. Now, that said, I would normally pack a helmet in so it couldn't move, especially if I was riding with a helmet in, maybe picking up a pillion somewhere that didn't have their own helmet, but I would would expect some movement and it did take a little bit more force than usual to shut the lid and it's time to break out the Bassett's Jelly Babies uh, taken over by Maynard's seems to be but there you go so what I'll do is tape a jelly baby into position over the point where the pannier seems to be the tightest and shut the lid give it a minute and then open it and have a look at the jelly babies and here you can see the difference the one on the left is the one that was taped to the side of the helmet the bag the one on the right is a brand new shiny jelly baby that hasn't been molested. But if you notice, if you press down on a jelly baby, and they are rather sticky, they do bounce back a long way. So there's obviously a lot of crushing on the one that I attached to the bag. So let's try my usual helmet in a helmet bag. It's a Schubert C5. So we'll open up the pannier, chuck the helmet in and try and close the pannier. And as you can see, it doesn't quite fully close. So unfortunately, although an AGV compact will just about fit in with or without a helmet bag, a Shubath won't. Oh, come on, Yamaha and other bike manufacturers that make panniers, make it big enough to get uh, the largest flip-up helmet you can find in. You're doing your customers a disservice by not making your luggage suitable. But then again, most riders aren't like me. They don't tend to ride long distances and high mileage every year and eat their jelly babies feet first. People who say you should bite the heads off they're nowhere near cruel enough because if you eat them feet first you can hear them scream for longer. Anyway that's enough from me. Tatty bye now. Hope to see you on the road sometime soon. Bye.